for this tribute to legendary Burt Reynolds. His look, his attitude, his persona were one of a kind. So today we join here in Eisenhower Park in the town of Hempstead to mourn his loss. When I was a kid, Burt Reynolds was the, the biggest thing in the world. You know, the Cannonball Run and Longest Yard and Smokey and the Bandit. Yeah, he was the shit back then. He was a real man. I mean, words can't even describe how sexy he was. I mean, the tight jeans, the mustache, the hat, the glasses, anything that the man was in was fabulous. He made this car famous. So when I think of this car, I think of Burt Reynolds, just like automatic. <laughs> to us, this is for Burt. This is our memorial for him. If it wasn't for him, I never would have fallen in love with this car. It's all him. It's all him. Uh, we come to all car shows, especially when we heard that there was going to be Trans Ams in tribute to, to Burt Reynolds. One of the best movies of all time is Smokey and the Bandit. And, the, and we also came here because I love car shows. I got the belt buckle, the shirt, which he wore in uh, Smokey and the Bandit 2, the hat, which he wore in Smokey and the Bandit 2, and, uh, and the watch, and the ring, which he wore in Smokey and the Bandit 1. I'm surprised that I won best costume because I came here for for the memorial on Burt Reynolds. I really Id I idolized him. I made this collage. Oh, this is when I met Mr. Reynolds in June. This is a picture that my uh, girlfriend Jackie took. And this is one of uh, him with the Hooper car. But we, oh, we didn't take that one. That one we, we got off the, the computer, off the internet. Everybody wanted to be a part of it. People were wearing banded shirts and Trans Ams were the hottest car out there. They're sexy. They're glamorous. They make a blonde look fabulous. And back then, you know, I was living with my grandmother and she looked out the window and says, gee, that guy's got a beautiful car. Uh, I think it says a lot about Firebird Trans Am. All right, now we're gonna ask all our Trans Am owners to get behind the wheel, rev those engines. I think we're gonna start our seven horn salute. Three, two, one. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 